Nat 20. Welcome back to Nat 20, A Deal with Demons. In our previous episode, our adventures had escaped, for, well, uh, saved a lot of prisoners from a prison and brought them to the edge of a large cavern in the depths that looks to be a prison camp of some kind. They befriended, that's in quotations, a, uh, a Balazow and got him to plant some explosives or, uh, at a tunnel that goes to some cabins for the Fardana and some other guards. Got a bunch of guards to go there and got a, the Fardana captain and one of his mages to come with him to where you guys are standing right now. Uh, you have befriended a second Balazow, that's again in quotations, and uh, the Shardana mage and Shardana captain just saw you. Lazarus is trying to run near them or past them, and everyone has already rolled for initiative. Uh, oh yeah, and once again we have Drew as a guest who is playing Tal. I'll be there. And... Uh, Farron was not able to make it as of right now. <laughs> but if he wakes uh, up, he'll join us. If if he ever shows up, he's he's not invited. And so I think we'll just start with going into the battle. Great. <clears throat> Wait. So, so right. Oh, sorry. Go ahead. Did uh, we just he, trade sorry. wild magic sorcerers, basically? <laughs> <laughs> Pretty much, yeah. Well, Tal was going to be in the fight anyway. I know, but like usually when someone's not here, they're not like yeah. important. <laughs> Sebastian's not going to be present for the death of his character. I can't. I can't <laughs> wait. It's going to be fucking gold. That's that's exactly the chaotic ending he deserves. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Um, Gage, before we get into it, can you just remind me of where everybody is right now? Yeah. I'm so, in my room. uh, I'm at a home. <laughs> I'm in Alabama. So, if you look at the map of this area, yeah, uh, I think everyone is just to the right of the entrance. Okay. Uh, Blaze was... No, I don't think anyone was hiding behind any rocks or anything. I think everyone was just kind of going towards the Fridana mage and captain. Uh, Borknork... And the Dragonborn, whom you saved from the prison, are still in the hallway that goes back to the Demon Town. And they're there kind of just to protect the uh, ten other prisoners who you guys had saved. And Borknork is ready to uh, set fire to explosives that are a bit further back in the tunnel. Because there are people from the t Demon Town coming your way from there as well. Perfect. Okay. So once they're close enough, where once he gets the sense that you guys are about to set the explosives near the cruise cabins, he will uh, fire those explosives to cause a cave in. Got it. Okay. Good to go. Wow. All right. So, of the uh, the picture you sent me, are we by the hole punch hole, or are we near those buildings? No, you're near the hole punch hole. Okay. Just to the right of that. Fantastic. I'm not sure why Tal needs to know that, but it's good to know. <laughs> uh, so, yeah, uh, in this fight, we've got all of you guys. Uh, Borknork as backup, and same with the Dragonborn in case something happens. Mm -hmm. We've got two Balazow that are on your side currently. A Shardana captain, a Shardana mage. And the, there are also a few Oblexes or Oblexes a bit further off and a couple other Balazow a bit further off, but you can't see them just because of how dark it is. And I have no key. <laughs> yep. I have we no are, spells. We are fucked. I do still have one of each, one first, second, and third, and then the five sorcery points, so I can buy in some more spells Ooh, good. if you need to. Yo, let's get ready we for this melee to. fight. Unfortunately, I did stock mostly fire spells, but we'll make it work. 
Boy, oh boy, I hope people aren't resistant to non-magical bludgeoning, piercing, or slashing in this fight. It's all good. I'm resistant to fire damage, so if you have to hit somebody, hit me. Right, we goofed that last time. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. Well, I forgot I was resistant. (laughs) Yeah, didn't you hit me instead? Yep. It was you or Sebastian, I can't remember. I I think it was me, because I had to jump out of the fucking way. It's not Um, important. (laughs) So are we rolling initiative? Uh, so we rolled at the end of the last session. Mm-hmm. Cal got a 15. Okay. Nice. Let's fuck what did Ryan doing? get? Like a 3? Uh, Ryan got a 10. Oh, wow. Think, that's like an all-time high. I think I was baller. I think I got like... I think I got like... I got a solid 23, so I think. pretty good. Okay, so I'll, I'll just go over <laughs> the initiative right now and what I've written rolled. Sweet. So the order is the Shardana Captain who got an at 20. Then it, uh, then it is Blaze, who got a 21. Nice. Then is Tal, who got a 15. Then the Dragonborn, although he probably won't do anything because he is just there to protect the other prisoners. Then it will go to Lazarus, who got a 12. Then Ryan, who got a 10. Then Borknork, who got a 7, although he'll probably just protect the prisoners. Mm-hmm. Uh, then Farron, who got a 5, then the Shardana Mage, who got a 4, and then the two Balazao, who got a 1 and a 2. Sick. So, so first is the Shardana Captain, and he, uh, you guys, uh, I'd say you guys are probably about 30 feet apart right now. So he is going to use his act I mean use his movement to run up to the closest person who would be Zach since he was trying to run past him. Okay. And he's gonna use multi attack on you. Just try it. Great. <laughs> Fucking try it. <laughs> I dare you. So he's using a great sword on Dio. you come at me. It's a fantastic sword. What the fuck? Q laugh track here. Oh, is it a great sword? <laughs> uh, he got a dirty <laughs> 20 on his first attack, Zach. I have a 21 AC. Alright. No, you don't. Are you actually going to put in a laugh? Fuck. You're not there. I don't, yeah. <laughs> yeah. How do you know? <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> How do you know? And then he got a an 11 on his second attack. Which what are you going to do? Go to his hit. fucking room and check? So his first great sword attack is uh, seven plus four damage, so eleven damage. Not a problem. And that is slashing damage. Yo, we're fucked. Oh, I'm, 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 I'm definitely fucked. Are you kidding me? No, I think you are. And that is his full attack. And he pretty much saw you guys and just went straight for you guys. Like, nice. he knows something's off and does not trust you and doesn't, like, have, like, free people being there. Even though one of us is wearing a demon face? <laughs> no, he, tr- he, <laughs> he trusts that one. He's not I mean, sure about that, and, and he's kind of concerned that a little tiefling girl is here. Oh, I mean, honestly, I feel like it'd be weird if he did trust us. <laughs> yeah. Uh, so next is Blaze. Sick. Okay, so I'm fuck. I'm about to, bro. Uh, I'm just gonna whip one dagger. Then I'm gonna whip another dagger, and then you know what I'm gonna do? I'm gonna hit him with my quarter staff. I'm gonna do all three of that shit. Okay, so first dagger is the obsidian dagger. Rolled a fifteen. And are you hitting? Are you aiming for the Shardana captain? Or yeah, that's the... who I was supposed to kill. They told okay. me to kill the captain. So okay, so fifteen for the first 15 one does not hit. That's some hot trash. Uh, oh, good. <laughs> the next one is well. even worse. Yeah. So nope. And then for my quarter staff. Oh, that's much better. That's uh, twenty-two. Twenty-two. Yeah, that definitely hits. <laughs> okay, cool. Twenty-two so that's not one hit. Six because that was my quarter staff. Oh yeah, five plus four, nine damage. Nine damage. Yeah, okay. and then I'm going to run away. <laughs> <laughs> I'm 
I'm going to back up another 30 feet. Okay, uh, so if you do that, you will have to take an opportunity attack. Oh. Wait, is he, like, right up in melee range with me? He's right beside me. You hit him with your well, quarterstaff. Well, if you were hitting him with your quarterstaff, yeah, he would be. Oh, yeah, good point, good point. Fuck. That makes sense. Damn it, Clayton. Is that, that a reflex in that? Just stay there. No, 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 it's a quarterstaff. Uh, yeah, I'll just stay there then and hiss at him. Go. Oh, okay. <laughs> okay. Bad, Shardana. <laughs> Is that supposed to be a hiss? Okay, so as you throw, as he's running towards you, you kind of threw a dagger at him. It missed. Threw the second one, and again it missed. He just barely dodged out of the way of it. And then w- once he's finally close enough, you finally get a shot in with your quarterstaff. Yeah, bop right away in the, the nose. Noggin. Bop, bop, bitch. All right. And then next is Cal. Okay, so I found some of my spell cards. So, um, I think I'm going to use, um, oh, nope, never mind. I have to make a range weapon attack. Shoot, sorry, I was coming up with a plan. Um, Most plans fall apart. We're used to it. It's it's because it's a... Uh, you have to make a ranged spell. Wait. It's a ranged weapon attack. So I don't want to do that. Um, I will stab. <laughs> with my daggers. <laughs> against uh, the guy who's in melee range. Okay. Yeah, that would be the captain. Yeah, and that's... Uh, like a tiefling Chucky doll. A ten. Okay, the crit definitely hits, of course. Okay. The ten does not. Yeah, that makes that makes sense. Um, You're like a, a horned Chucky doll. What does that mean? Well, like Chucky doll, like um, running around with a knife, stabbing people because he's like damage. a little small. Ten damage. Ten damage. Not a lot for a crit, but that's okay. I'll come up with a okay. better plan for next time. Hey, you know what? Good job. Thank you. Yeah, you hit him. Everything Good job, counts. buddy. <clears throat> um, so the moment after uh, Blaze just hit him with his quarterstaff, you see that he's just turned to the side a little bit, and you just find the perfect opportunity to plunge your dagger right into the on, into his side. Cool beans. And any bonus attacks or anything like that? Um, or I guess the knife, the first. The second knife was your bonus, right? Right, that is how that works. Yep. Okay. Uh, so next is the Dragonborn. He's just keeping an eye out, and he hears the people from the town coming closer and closer. But he's not... He's kind of just standing in between them, who are still a bit off, and the prisoners. What? what is, are, isn't he going to... Set off the charges? Yeah, uh, you guys had told Borknork to set them off once you guys set off the ones at the uh, guard cabins. Yeah. Oh, I just figured that kind of plan got shit for shit because we were going to do that so like we were going to sneak up on the captain and then kill him quietly. But now we're like full on fighting, so like, what's the point? <laughs> yeah, yeah. Yeah, Fuck. He will probably set them off before the people from the town get too close anyway, so... True, he's yeah, a somewhat he intelligent person. Yeah. Uh, next is Lazarus. Okay, I'll use my action to disengage, and then uh, since I can't dash, I'll just run 30 feet down the hall, closer to the okay. uh, other entrance. Okay, sure. Uh, you are now also... Pretty close to the Shardana Mage. How close? Like within seven feet. Okay. Uh, I'll use my bonus action to throw a dagger at him. Okay. Uh, let's see. Uh, I got a nat one. Don't worry about it. <laughs> <Okay>. <laughs> good start. Good start, guys. Good start. You also saw that as he was 
as he and the Shardana captain were approaching you guys, you saw him sort of have some kind of dark magical glow around all around him. Does it match my my curse he glow? No, it does not. <laughs> okay. Uh, so next will be either Ryan or Aelrindal, who both had tens. Okay. All right. Um. So he is uh, within you can go, thirty Ryan. feet, right? So I can run up to him and yeah, melee the mage. Him. No, the 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 short handed captain. Yeah, he is like great near yeah, you guys. Yeah, like yeah, he's okay. probably 10, 15 feet away at most. Okay, so I'm gonna run up to him and uh, um, thinking about all the people that have been enslaved and all the kids that have been taken from their homes. Ryan is just raging, not like barbarian raging, but you know he's just mad. Oh, um, I got excited. And I thought you no, were no, no. <laughs> yeah, I took a I took a level in barbarian. Um, no, uh, and. Uh, so just for flavor, he's going to bite his tongue so that he bleeds and spit a big bloody mass in the Shardana captain's face. Brutal. Um, and, uh, oh, but, but, okay, first, bonus action, I'm drinking a strength potion that I've got. Oh, dope. So that's plus five to strength. Um, and then going to spit in his face and I'm going to uh, give a battle cry and hit him with my battle hammer. Okay, sweet. Okay, so that is... Uh, <laughs> okay, uh, 24, 5, 30 to hit. Holy yeah, that shit. definitely hits. Oh, oh I yeah. have the worst rolls. Oh, hey, oh. fuck off. <laughs> Fucking drops a 30. <laughs> <laughs> it's because of the strength potion. Oh, 31, my bad. Yeah. Um, <laughs> uh, okay, so... What's this dice? Here we go. 8. Plus six, plus seven, fifteen damage. Fifteen damage. Fifteen damage. So he is gonna use his parry. Mm-hmm. Or actually, no, never mind. That just adds AC. So never mind. So ten, fifteen damage. You said. Yeah, fifteen. Okay. Does it look like the damage is like hurting him? Yeah, it definitely is hurting him. Okay, cool. I just want to make sure he wasn't. But he seem he is this drawn and burly dude. Okay, cool. Uh, any bonus actions or anything, Ryan? Uh, my I I use my bonus action to drink the potion. So. Oh, okay. Yeah, uh, that's, that, right. that's my turn. Okay. But I, I'm just I'm just gonna get right in his face and you know real feral like just growl. Okay, he yeah. definitely did not like being spat at. Yeah. He did not like your hit. So. Yeah. Okay. I That's like okay. this, Ryan. This is sexy, Ryan. <laughs> I'm the tank anyway. I'm meant to take hits. Next is Aelrindel. Yes, yeah, so... How, uh... How close is the nearest mofo to me? Uh, the Shardana captain would probably be the closest. He's with, probably within 10 to 15 feet of you. And then the... Okay. Uh, Shardana That's mage is say. probably around 30 feet to the... Okay, East that, of you. that that mother freaking captain dude. Yeah. I'm gonna run up. I'm gonna pull out my longsword, and I'm gonna slash down on him. Okay. Uh, so uh, does a ten hit? <laughs> it does not. No matter. Second attack, whatever. I swing that shit back around. And I'm going to try attacking him again. Okay. Oh, shit. Dice run off my desk. Oh, <laughs> natural 20. Nice. Yeah, definitely it. Baby. Don't. Fucking name drop. <laughs> Hell yeah. Please let that fucking um, joke die. <laughs> never. So now I just got to roll. D8. Where's my D8? Um, and then, do you want me to roll twice, or just double my roll? No, uh, roll twice. Okay, fucking I. Just wait, I'm trying to find my fucking d8. Uh, so that's 12 slashing damage, and 3 necrotic. Okay, so 15 altogether. Okay. 
Uh, so after you like on your first win, he kind of just barely ducks on under it, and it was like just inches above his head. And then after that, you see that he's ducked down, so you just smash your sword at him, and it seems to take a lot of. He seems to take a fair amount of damage from that. Heck yeah. And uh, any bonus actions or movement or anything? Um, no, I don't think so. I think I'm just gonna, I'm just gonna stay there. Okay. So next is Borknork. Uh, he's just gonna, uh, prepare an action to throw the uh, firebolt. Once the uh, townspeople get close. And then next is Farron, who is just going to try to firebolt the mage. Uh, he hits him, I think. Yeah, he just barely hits him. And is firebolt a d10? I believe it's a d8. D8? Okay. Uh, let me check. Uh, I've got it here. 1d10. Oh, 1d10. Oh, okay. Hell yeah. And uh, it increases by 1d10 when you reach 5th level. Oh, sweet. So, so 2d10. You did 17 damage against the mage. Wow. Uh, just want to double check. Yeah, so he does 17 damage against the mage. Mage. That's what you get when you fuck with us. And then next will be uh, the mage. So since Zack is right near him, he is going to not hit me. He's going to cast hold person on you. Oh no. So that is a... Or, uh, no, he's actually going to use a uh, firebolt on you. Rude. Try and hit me. He got a 15. Nope. Does that hit? Damn it. Okay. Okay, so next is... The first Balazel. So he's going to go after the captain, I guess. And he is going to run up to him and hit him with his barbed tail. He's using tail whip. <laughs> Pikachu, go! That's a 17. Uh, the Shardana captain is going to use his reaction to use parry, which adds 2 to his AC, so it does not hit. Parry this, you filthy casual. <laughs> <laughs> what the fuck? <laughs> and then the next Balzao is going to do the exact same thing, and he does not hit. So we are back to the top of the order with the Shardana captain. Come at me, big guy. Oh, fuck. And yeah. he's gonna go for Ryan. Oh. Since he kind he cut since he kind of pissed him off. Yeah. Bring it on, you and, slimy twat. <laughs> and he is once again gonna use multi attack. He has to hit me, dude. <laughs> I like hockey, Ryan. <laughs> <laughs> He got a dirty 20. Oh, okay, yeah, that actually hits me. <laughs> oh, fuck. <laughs> uh, so that's his first attack. He's going to swing it twice, though. Got a 21. Well, yep, yeah, yep. Yeah, that, that'll that hit. Good thing you're a tank. Yeah. So the first attack is worth uh, 14 damage, staff and damage. Wow. And then the second is... Uh, 10 staff and damage. Wow. Oh my god, bro. Tis but a that, scratch. That's like half my health. <laughs> that's 
14 and 10. Yep. That's not even a third of my health. My health is... And he's so kind of sh- going to snarl at you after that hit. That's all you've got? He says, there's more where that came from. I bet you, there is. You're damn right there is. And I'm... Oh, fuck yeah. And the Nexus Blaze. Yeah, I'm going to fucking hit that guy in the face three times. Uh, or can I do... No, I don't have a key. Never mind. Yeah, I'm just going to hit him in the face with my quarterstaff because my I don't have my daggers right now. Yeah. So I'm gonna wait, wait, wait. I'm gonna I'm gonna hit him with my dagger. I'm not my dagger, my quarter staff. But I'm also going to punch him in the face with prayers. Okay. Yeah. So first two are quarter staff. Uh, nine plus seven is eighteen. No, that's sixteen. That is his armor class, so that does not hit. Oh, what a fucking whore. As okay. you, you go to hit him with the cord staff, and it kind of just bounces off his scale mail. Okay, that's fine, because then I rolled a 19 plus 7. Okay. <laughs> so fuck that guy. He's taking that 1d6 plus dex. Plus, so 8 damage with the quarter staff, and then I'm going to punch him in the face with prayers. Which is uh, another 16. What the hell? You gave yeah, me all your bad luck. You hit me with all your bad luck, Duncan. You motherfuckers. It had to pass on eventually. Only one okay, person well, can be lucky at a time. Yeah. <laughs> this this sucks. Um, That's how I feel all the time. So after you hit him with the quarter staff, it knocks him back just a, like, less about a foot. And you go to punch, but you're punching where he was. So I'm, I'm just, just, ta- I'm just taking it easy on you, you bitch. Uh, showing mercy say thank you and uh, he just shakes his head that and then next is tell okay so i am gonna ask would uh thunder wave or witch bolt be better thinking witch bolt uh, witch bolt guy. yeah okay yeah go- then, give me um, old witch bolt going to do witch bolt on him um boop, boop. I make a ranged spell attack, so here we go. Pick my good dice. There's a, like, 22 to hit. Yeah, that definitely hits. Nice. Yeah. Uh, yep, 22. Good guess, Drew. Um, <laughs> I didn't know what my spell casting modifier was, but it's 6, so I was right. Um, that is 1d12 lightning damage. Is it 2d12 because you're 5th level? I think or is that just it goes a spell? up if you use it as a higher level. I'm using oh, okay. a 1st level spell slot. Okay, That is 11 damage, though. 11 damage, okay. Yeah. Uh, and I can just keep spamming that one. I don't think I even have to roll attacks after this. Yeah, that's right. Yeah. I should have done uh, What does Witch Bolt do? Is it like ener- is it a beam of like energy or is it force? Blue energy lances out towards a creature within range, forming a sustained arc of lightning between you and the target. So it's like okay, Darth Sidious attack. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> nice. So you just see this lightning come out of this little girl and it just implants itself straight into the Friday cabin and you see Sparks just flying all throughout him. And that Children does not scary. stop. It's going to happen again next round. <laughs> and then next is... Uh, the Dragonborn, who is not going to do anything yet. He's just going to hold an action in case something comes this way. Then next after that is Lazarus. Okay. Uh, this mage isn't within melee range, right? Yeah. He is? Or he's not? Yeah, he is. Or, uh, he would be seven okay. feet away from you, I think I said before. I'll use my action to dash, uh, away from him. I'm okay. just going to ignore everybody and blow up that, uh, tunnel. Nice. Okay. 
as I'm running, I'll also rip off a piece of my tunic, I guess, and uh, wrap it around one of my arrows so I can light it on fire. Okay. Is that a uh, so fire? by adaption, you're able to get just to like where the corner is, and you look to your left and you see that there's a ba- another Balazel, uh standing uh, up ahead as well as a Oblex spawn that's to that in front of you and to the right a bit. That's kind of devouring uh, the memories of someone who's dead okay. right now. Uh. How far away would the tunnel be? The tunnel would be... Uh, let me just double check this. I think it is 300 feet away. Damn. Okay. It's a very large cavern you're in right now. And how far away is this uh, Balzao and the Ublex? The Balzao would be about 100 feet away. The Ublex would be... Uh, 50 feet away. Yeah, so so you guys know the mine, so the actual part that uh, is below is below you and to well, that isn't on the same level as you, is about 500 by 700 feet. Oh. So it's a, like it's a ginormous room you're in. Fucking dope. Uh, so any bonus actions or anything, Nazars? Uh, no, I don't think I can really do anything. Okay. Uh, next will be, uh, Ryan. Uh, okay. Yeah, I'm just gonna wind up and smack him with my hammer again. Okay. And that'll be. Uh, 12 to hit. That does not hit. Alright, that's cool. Any bonuses or anything? (laughs) Nope. I am tapped. That's all I can do. Moving on. Okay. Okay, so, Aelrindel. I'm gonna fucking swing my sword, baby. (laughs) Melee fights. Yeah, I'm just going to attack the captain again, okay. like with my sword. Melee fights. Melee fights. Um, so here I go. Wish me luck. Good luck. Thanks, man. Yeah, I got you, bro. <gasps> hmm. That was uh, a 13. Yeah, that does not hit. Okay, well. <clears throat> uh, second verse, same as the first. I'm going to swing <laughs> again. Oh. Oh, and like last time, this one, well, it's not a natural 20, but it's over 20. Second okay. verse, same as the first. Yeah, definitely it. Hell yeah. All right. Uh, oh, fucking A. Uh, 11 slashing and 4 necrotic damage. How do you do this? Um, nice. Well, I, Fuck him up. So I take my first swing at him, um, and of course I I kind of slash from my right to the left, and I guess I miss him or he like steps back. Oh. Um, then my second one, like I'm gonna kind of bring my sword back and I'm gonna like just go to like stab him with it. Okay. Like in the, just straight in the chest. Okay. Yeah, you do this, and when you stab, you're able to kind of lift him up. And he just is bewildered at this, and then you, and then he kind of just falls off of your sword, dead. Nice, like a shish kebab. Uh, any have- bonus actions or anything else? Um, no, I don't. I don't do anything right now. Okay, I'm good. That was epic. Uh, so next is Farron. Who's going to fire both this Shredana Mage again? Uh, that does not hit. Just a 13. So next is the Shredana Mage. Uh, seeing that you 
Seeing that Lazarus is running ahead, he's going to aim a firebolt at you, Lazarus, again. Still can't hit me. I don't think so, because that's a 9 plus 6, so yeah, 15. Yeah, still doesn't hit. Okay. Too fast. Uh, so next is the Balzow. So it is going to... Uh, so you, when you charm these two Balzow, you guys had just told them to attack the captain. So they're just going to... Uh, they're not going to attack the mage at all this round. And then next it is Blaze. Um, so, fuck. I mean, who's near me then? Uh, there's the Shardara Mage who's about 30, maybe 35 feet away from you. Okay. And that's like the closest thing, right? Yeah. Yeah, you don't see any of the other, any other enemies around you. Alright, well, fuck it. I have a 40 foot speed, so I'm just gonna run right at that mage, and I'm gonna... Like, I'm going to, like, running leap punch him in the face with prayers. And then okay. after I do that, I'm going to just, like, pummel the shit out of him with pr- pr- prayers again. I'm just going to hit him three times with prayers. So that is 16 plus 7 is 23. Yeah, that hits. Okay, and then for the second one, that is 18 plus 7. And, ooh, 2 plus 7. So the first two hit. Okay. So each each one with prayers is 3d4 lightning damage. Uh, radiant damage, sorry. Okay. Don't do that. Okay, so the first one deals 4. Do I add anything to that, or is it just straight up the radiant damage? Uh, just the radiant. No strength or anything? Okay. Or actually, yeah, I guess your strength would be added. Okay, so then that's 6 damage for the first one. Then, nice, 4 plus... One is five plus one is six plus two is eight damage. Eight damage. Okay. Nice. Yeah. So eight for the second, and then the third misses. So okay. I just I take up up. I'm gonna take a note out of Ryan's book, and I'm just gonna fucking spit in his face. Okay. But yeah, he does not like this at all. Hell yeah. yeah. You're a yeah. We're hardcore. And next is. Uh, Tal. Oh, I'm gonna do my uh, D12 of Witch Bolt again. That's on the Shardana Captain who is dead. Ah, oh, damn it. Um. Wow, nice job, Arendelle. I did run to go pee in the middle of that, so. Oh, okay. That's why I didn't know that. Yeah. Um. I don't know. Well, I could spend. Some sorcery points and do it against somebody else. How does that sound to y'all? Because that seems like a good thing for me to be using right now. Fuck them up, dude. Um, okay, yeah. Who's looking the next most healthy out of all these guys? So the only other enemy you see at the moment is the Shardana Mage. Oh. Just because you got your sight, all of your sights is limited to your dark vision. Oh, okay. Well then, I think I might just go do some steps. It's just a mage, so you're still playing, going all crazy on him. Stabby stab. Uh. Twelve? That does not hit. Alright, I missed both times. Okay. Whoops. Sorry, guys. So, as you. He dodges the first stab, and then the second one you think you're going to hit, but it kind of gets deflected off of this almost black magical surface that, or black magical aura that's surrounding him. And then next is Lazarus. Okay. I kind of want to keep running, but it's 300 feet. And there's only the mage behind me left for enemies, right? 
there's the mage behind you. There's an oblex spawn that's about, I think I said 70 feet to your, uh, in front of you and to the, your right. And then there's a Balazao that is 200 feet away. Okay. In front of you. I won't dash. I'll just move up 30 feet and I'll multi attack the Ublex with my longbow. Okay. So, first one is going to be a 21, second one is a dirty 20. Yeah, both. Okay. Uh, 1d8. 8 and 11, so 19. How do you... Well, I guess you're just firing there. Yeah. But you, you see that... As it's consuming the memories of the dead person, it's over. You see it start to gain like a almost human-like head. And it seems to start to form into almost like a human. Similar looking to the human that you see below it. Okay. And so you just aim for that head and you hit it and it just splatters everywhere. And just kind of slimes to the Boom, floor. Boom, headshot! 360 no scope. Okay, uh, I guess that's all I can do. Okay. Uh, so next is. Uh, where was that? Next is Ryan. Okay, so the captain's dead, right? Yep. Yeah. And the mage is not. Nope. Uh, okay, I guess we'll just get as far as I can towards the mage. How far away is he? The mage is about 35 feet away from you. Stellar. Okay. Well, I have 25 feet of movement speed, so I'm going to walk up to him and stay there because I can't do anything else. Throw your hammer. Okay. The, the, no, not going to. I you guess mean, I do you have do a have dagger. The dawn sword that he can throw and. Yeah, but I don't have it uh, attuned. Oh, okay. Yeah. Wait, you have a dawn sword you can throw? Yeah, it's like a double-sided longsword, I think. Yeah, but I'm not proficient with it, I don't think, so I'm not attuned to it. Um, yeah. Yeah, I guess I do have a dagger, though, so I guess I can chuck a dagger at him. My dex is shit, though. That's my thing. Yeah. You can use strength because it's a uh, finesse. Is dagger finesse? Yeah, oh, okay. So. Dag- well, okay. Daggers aren't finesse. Aren't they solely dex-based? I can't remember. Let's check. I think they're finesse. Um, well, I guess if you're throwing it, I think it's just dex. Uh, dagger. If you're no, stabbing with it, it can be dex or strength. It's finesse, yeah, it's light, finesse. and thrown. But I think if you throw a weapon, I don't think you get strength. I think it's, no, it it'd only be dex. Yeah. Neat. Okay, well, I'll, I'll try it and see. That's a 10... 10 to hit. Yeah, no, that misses. Yeah, clatters. Away. Just flies past him. Alright, that's my uh, turn. That's all I can do. That's all she got. Okay. Hey, you know what? You did what? your best. Thank you. did your best. I'm proud of you. Next is Aelrindel. Hell yeah. Oh. Um, so, uh, killed that captain. Yep. Very epic. Very cool. Um, the closest is that, that mage, correcto? Yep. All right. And, uh, how far away is he? Cause you said he was 35 from Duncan, but were you right? Were you by the captain yeah. before? Okay. Yeah. So he'd be 35 feet away from you. Um, Bro, he's mine. I'm going to shoot my long, I'm going to shoot a, a arrow at him with my longbow. Okay. So, here we go. Uh, that is a 17. Yeah, that hits. Back off, bro. He's mine. Heck yes. No, dude, I got dude, him. I'm helping dude, you. Dude, you're pissing me off. <laughs> dude. Dude. If you fucking kill him, I swear to God. <laughs> I don't know. The, uh, four piercing. Four piercing? Okay. Yeah. That does not kill him. Oh. 
Uh, the arrow just sticks in his leg. Hell yeah. I was, Hit him in those thighs. I was half tempted to just go for catch missiles there. <laughs> uh, next is Farron, who's just going to try to firebolt him again, because that's the only cantrip I know that he has. He also has Ray of Frost. Uh, he hits him. Fuck! And I just want to double check one thing first before anything happens. So, how's everyone day been? Sure. So the firebolt would do 10 damage, but the mage is using counterspell as a reaction. And it does not hit. Yes! Counterspell doesn't send the spell back at it, does it? No, it just cancels out the spell before it's even made. Okay, that's what I thought. Okay, sweet. Uh, so next is the mage. You can come at me, bro. Uh, he... So who all is right near this mage? I'm right up against him. I punch him in the face like three times. I tried to stab okay. him. Oh yeah, Tal's okay. here. What up, Tal? Howdy. And Ryan, you're ten mm-hmm. feet away? Yeah. Okay. Uh, Aelon Doll's there too? Or no, you just shot well, a no, arrow, I, right? I'm still by the captain okay. because I just shot my bo- my arrow at him. Okay, he is going to use Thunder Wave on the three of you. So Tal, Ryan, and Blaze. Hold on, I cast Counterspell. <laughs> Wait, I'm a monk. Fuck. <laughs> uh, so can you please roll Constitution saving throws? Oh, shit, okay. it's, it's Constitution? I think so. Let me. Yeah, it is. That. Ooh, oh, that's mad shit, bro. Yes. Okay, I have plus zero, but I rolled seventeen. So. Okay. Uh, you succeeded. You need to be day fourteen. Tal did not. Nine. Tal critically failed. No. Okay. I got a fifteen. Fifteen. Yeah. Okay. Uh, he's using this uh, third level. Oh. Yikes. I think. Oh, what an asshole. Check. What an asshole. Yeah, third level. What a right cunt. That is... <laughs> so fine. Massive cunt move right there. That is 21 force damage. Oh, fuck. Okay, uh, uh, when we... Do you round up or down when taking half? Uh, You can round down. Okay, six, so I take 10 damage. And tell you are not uh, 15 feet away, or 10 feet back. Yeah. And this just, re- a enormously loud boom just resonates throughout this large cavern. Okay. Some of it is drowned out in some areas due to the other explosions that are happening down below, and the cries of pain and the sounds of mining and people. Uh, and then just the two Balazows. They have not been told to do otherwise, so they're kind of just chilling. That's fair. And uh, next is the Balaz- the other Balazow who just saw Lazarus, but he is not in range, so he's just going to dash 40 feet. I mean, uh, 80 feet towards you. So I think you are, uh, he is 120 feet away from you. Or no, uh, he'd be 100 feet away from you, Lazarus. And we are back to the top of the order, so Blaze. Fuck yeah, bro. Um, I am going to cat's claws this mage in the face, then I'm going to quarterstaff this mage in the face, and I'm going to punch him with prayers in the face. Okay. I literally just want to make his face feel nothing but pain. Oh, nat one on the claws. Unfucking fortunate Um, but that's okay, because I have two more attacks. Yes, yeah, 17 plus 7. Yeah, that definitely hits. Okay, so that's the quarterstaff. And then for prayers, 
You fucking uh oh, you fucking hate to see it. Fifteen? Uh fifteen is his armor class, so does not hit. <sighs> That's fine. Uh then where's my D six? Oh <laughs> one plus four is five damage with the quarter staff. Big hits. That kills him. Yes! <laughs> yes! I am all powerful! <laughs> so how do you do this? Uh, how close are we to the edge? Uh, you're Don't probably kick him off. 15 feet from Some's the edge. Someone's gonna notice. Dude, I really wanted to just like pick him up and like Someone's him gonna notice. Edge. He's gonna scream all yeah. the way down. All the fu- all the uh, 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 explosions we're about to make isn't gonna make anyone. Yeah, notice. but that's still like at least five or six turns from now. <laughs> also, all right. uh, some would have the thunder wave would have made something. Yeah. I wasn't gonna say anything, but yeah. <laughs> yeah, no, fuck just, that. Then I'm gonna like, run clean. up. And horizontally slam my staff into his throat and just push him off the edge. Okay. Bye bye. Yeah. So you were able to hit him with enough force with your core staff that it knocks him back about fifteen feet, and he just stumbles over to the edge and dies. Everything is. Falling apart for you. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> got him. <laughs> Fucking got him. Uh, Lazarus, can you roll a perception check? Please? I sure can. He notices that we're winning. That will be a 17. Yeah. 17. So, you're just barely able to see the tunnel ahead that you're heading towards and uh, you see that there is a Balazau there as well. So there's one Balazau that was somewhat near to the to the edge but is not at the edge anymore and is running towards you and you saw, see that there's a Balazau at that tunnel okay. as well. And you see another Oblak spawn near that tunnel as well. Tunnel's still like at least 250 meters away though, right? Okay. Yep. Uh, I won't worry about them now then. Okay. Is it my turn? Uh, right now we are s- somewhat out of initiative because you've killed the two enemies that were after you guys. And there, it'll be it? at least uh at least one round before the Balazau can actually get to you guys. Or get to you last. There was the one that was about 100 feet away from me, right? Yeah, I guess he would be in, in Yeah, range. I'm going to shoot him with my bow. But it would be your turn before it's his turn. Okay. Yeah, I'm not going to move up. Because he can dash 80 feet. I'm just going to stay here and shoot two arrows at him. Okay. Let's see. I almost got a nat one, but oh, that'll be. What does that fucking mean? It was at one, but then it rolled over to a fifteen. So that's a twenty-two on no nope, twenty-one on that, and a yeah, that twenty-five. Yeah, both hit. And Shit, I'm getting new dice. <laughs> eight, eight plus nine, seventeen. Yeah. 17. Okay. Uh, is there anything anyone else wants to do? I searched the captain's point? body. What? Okay. What do you do? Uh, as you search this body, you find a cir- uh, almost perfectly circular stone. It's like circular and flat, so it would be like a perfect skipping stone. Nice. But it has this slight almost black glow to it cool i skip it across the cab just kidding um 
Oh my, I was literally about to flip and just leave the chat. <laughs> I was about worry. to leave the voice chat. Oh my god. Um, cool. So I'm assuming this is a teleport stone that we needed to find. Yeah. Cool. Yep. I am gonna dash all the way towards Lazarus. Also, can you guys roll a perception check, please? Do I have to? Nope. <laughs> That's a natural oh. one. Fuck yes. Nine. Yeah. I had a 22. Feeling 22. 22. Okay. I got seven. Seven. Not a boy, Tony. Uh, seven. Cal? Seven. Thanks, seven's man. a lucky number. It is. Tell what the deal? Nine. Nine? Okay, so. 79. Uh, Blaze, you're the only one who sees this, but do you see a bal- bal- another Balazow? Coming from the opposite direction, so towards the left, from the left side of the map. He's probably about 200 feet away from me, though. Okay, um, can I signal Borknork to look out? Yeah, sure. Borknork! You're being Um, attacked! Do orcs have dark vision? I don't believe so. Ooh, can I, can I say, like, can I retrieve my daggers as well? Yeah, sure. Fuck yeah. Yeah, I'm gonna grab those as I'm running. Okay. Because I, I need those for things. Uh, let's see if orcs have dark vision. Well, half orcs have dark vision, so I'm assuming orcs do too. I mean, yeah, as long you, as you yeah. as long yeah. as you're not human, you usually have dark vision. Humans and halflings, I think. Fucking halflings. Yeah, uh, yeah. So uh, he does see you signaling, and he looks to the left and sees the Balazow running towards him, or towards you guys. So uh, you see him kind of disappear from the mouth of the tunnel, and then about eight seconds later, you hear this loud explosion, and then you hear the sound of an Almost like an earthquake. Well, no, earthquakes don't make sound, really. But you hear the sound of a cave and as tons of rocks just come falling from the ceiling into the tunnel. And you see a bunch of dust just come up from the tunnel that uh, Borknork was in. Oh, fuck yeah. And you assume that he sent, he let off the charges and the cave happened. But it sent a resounding explosion all throughout the cave. He died for a good cause. He's still alive. (laughs) He sent off the explosions far enough away that it wouldn't harm him or any of the prisoners. I mean, we don't know that. Damn it. Ah, as far as I know, he's dead! No! But you would assume that even a a simple-minded person wouldn't just explode (laughs) a bunch of explosives... Right near him. So I think you can probably assume he knew what he was doing. He is a somewhat intelligent person. Uh, and is there anything anyone else wants to do right now? Literally just run it towards Lazarus. Okay. I want to give him assistance. Okay. Uh, Ryan, Laz, uh, Aylrandel, Tal, anything? I'll go with Blaze and Lazarus then. Okay. Um, I guess I'll follow too. Okay. <laughs> yeah, I'm just gonna follow along. Do you I think Borknork will be able to defend the himself? Uh, don't care. Okay. I, <laughs> no, I think he'll be able. He'll be the, fine. He'll be fine. Inhabitants, you know, there's still like a dozen people there. I mean, I told you guys we shouldn't bring them, but. You yourself said you cared if they survive or not last session. I No, I'm saying this out of character. Oh, yeah. Yeah, yeah. In character, I hope they live, but yeah. <laughs> okay. Okay, uh, I think this is where we leave off on this episode of A Deal with Demons. Cool. I'm gonna come save you, Lazarus. I. Town Don't really is need saving. In a lot of pain. I'm gonna save you. It's gonna be okay. I got hit once. 
Tiles down to 11. <laughs>